Hello everybody, welcome to the Butterfly YouTube channel and Happy New Year! Uh, in the 2020 we are going to launch several new products and we start uh, with, a break, with a breaking news. Uh, last week we Signet has launched the new uh, SDS 2000 X Plus series. Uh, now we are going to make the unboxing and after we are going to make uh, to take a look to the specs. Thank you very much. Uh, this is an amazing uh, oscilloscope and let's go and open the box together with you after the unboxing into the same video I will go through the spec so stay uh, watching so let's see with this unit just arrived first uh, is the first bench for the for the our stock and actually since we launched we already sold uh, some units so this is really interesting. So let's start with the with the this carton box. Into this carton box, let's check what is inside. We have uh, the power cable, the USB cable, and uh, four four probes. Uh, bear in mind uh, the model is available. The series is available in uh, two and four uh, analog channel. If you choose the four channel, you will get four probes. If you choose the two channel, you will get two probes. Those are uh, what is inside. And uh, uh, you also have the certificate calibrator, calibration document, and uh, a quick start uh, paper uh, manual. Okay, so this is what is into the first box. Let's go and check what is uh, the real scope of the delivery so we have uh, a very good protection uh, very good space in case that during the shipment uh, something goes wrong we always remember that butterfly uh, ships uh, the instrument not only on the original box but we always use a secondary box for protection so there is a plastic cover Let's see if the plastic cover there is also, yeah, into the plastic cover there is also the dryer, which is good. And uh, here we have, uh, here we have the instrument. The instrument looks uh, really nice. There is a protection film on it, uh, four channel with the probe activation and recognition, the pod, uh, the digital pod for the connection of uh, the uh, logic probe, frontal, uh, port, and so on. So, this is the back side. And uh, yeah, so for the unboxing is everything. Let me change the view and I will describe you a little bit the instrument. Hello, uh, after the unboxing, we are here to check the specification of the new scope. And uh, for this case, we have a uh, Four channel unit in the moment we are going to check the quality and the specification let's uh, power on the unit so as i said this is the new sds 2000 x plus series for the european market siglent is going to uh, to export uh, only four models actually only is, uh, is a good line of model 100 200 and 350 megahertz and the model at 100 megahertz is available at two and four channel what is interesting is that we there is available the bandwidth upgrade from 100 to 200 to 350 and only the 350 model by hardware can be upgraded to 500 megahertz which means that if you buy the 100 or the 200 megahertz version you cannot go up to 500 megahertz so uh, as per the specification let's check the data sheet while i'm talking to you as i said we have a four model uh, we have uh, two giga sample uh, total one giga sample not interleaving there is a huge memory total 200 mega point of memory 100 mega point with the interleaving uh, there is a very very uh, fast acquisition 
a waveform rate. We go from normal mode from 120,000 waveform per second to sequence mode, which is 500,000 waveform per second. There is uh, about the vertical resolution I'm going to talk a little bit later. What is interesting is the unit offer, of course, a wide range of trigger and the math. What is interesting is that uh, it offer it comes from uh, as standard with I square C, SPI, UART, CAN, and LIN as a trigger and the code. As optional, which means that you can purchase immediately or after because our activation key, you can get CAN FD, Flex Ray, R, uh, E square S, which is the audio and the mid standard 1553B. Uh, something also very interesting, the unit is capable to do two mega points uh, FFT, so the FFT is a very a lot of point for the quality and uh, there are a lot of mathematics, a lot of mathematics. Uh, the display is a 10.1 inch uh, TFT LCD touchscreen display, so you can use the unit either with the keyboard and buttons or from uh, the uh, the display itself. Uh, the 100 and 200 model are supplied with the 200 megahertz probe and the 350 model is, uh, is supplied with the 350 megahertz probe, uh, part number SP2035A. So what else? There is a lot to do. Uh, the unit uh, offer the uh, trigger zone so you can set uh, manually shoot one or two trigger zone to catch the signal and uh, what is interesting what I said before about the resolution Siglent uh, uh, with this unit has uh, introduced an interesting concept which is the 10-bit mode actually is not based on 10-bit ABC converter but uh, uh, is not even based on the IRS as many other oscilloscopes does. So what uh, the engineer of, of Siglent um, did uh, was to uh, test the unit on each uh, parameter in order to get the best performance uh, for the 10 bit. In fact, in the moment I activate the 10 bit mode from 8 bit to 10 bit mode in any model, on any model, the bandwidth will be cut down to 100 megahertz and the memory is cut down to 100 mega point per second. With this limitation, you can activate the 10 bit mode with a substantial uh, improvement of uh, the vertical resolution. Uh, of course, there is a lot of things. Body plot is already included with the unit and uh, many, many other functionality. You can check the data sheet or our future video or other video online uh, to see the other functionalities. Uh, what is interesting uh, from the hardware point of view is that the unit is totally redesigned because this is uh, in the between of the existing SDS 2000X and the uh, <coughs> new SDS 5000X which was launched last year. What you can notice is that uh, you have uh, uh, in this unit you have only one control for all channel instead of the 5000 you have all four control. Uh, here you have the four channel analog, here you have the digital pod where you can connect the optional logic uh, probe with, which add 16 logic channel. But what is really interesting and at the moment I believe is almost unique, here you have uh, the single external source which is the signal generator and this is not what is special. What is special is that uh, the sine wave on this generator uh, goes up to uh, 50 megahertz. So this is interesting. Why? Because at the moment the standard is to offer 25 megahertz. And if you use the internal signal generator uh, to make a body plot uh, measurement or frequency response analysis measurement, you know that you use the sine wave and use whip the sine wave with several points. So all the other oscilloscopes at the moment offer the possibility to go up to 25 meg on the sine. This unit will offer to go up to 50 megahertz. Of course, you can also connect other signal generator from Siglent 
and with this uh, unit you can go up to uh, 500 megas so i believe the range is pretty is pretty is pretty wide for uh, the measurement uh, on the rear of the unit you can find of course the power you can find usb external trailer aux and the lan what is interesting is this unit already like the other unit offered by siglent as an internal web browser the web browser or the web server allow you to use the unit directly with the browser of the computer so you don't need to install any com any software uh, into the into the computer in order to use the uh, unit this also is good because you can use uh, mac uh, pc and uh, uh, linux all kind of computer you just need to ping the ip of the unit and then and then you are uh, you are set to go so mainly i would say i don't want to go too deep at the moment because we will make other video but i just wanted to give you a little bit of taste of the unit uh, after the unboxing so uh, please uh, if you like the video leave the thumb up share the video with your friend and your colleague and uh, what else check other video from our youtube channel subscribe and uh, again thank you very much for your time see you the next time bye